I've uh, got a big package. This typical mirror thing that we do is not gonna work out because this box is massive. I can finally open my Christmas present. <laughs> so this is the deluxe, most expensive, biggest. I backed all the things, got all the stuff. Let's find out what that entails. First off, set of four art prints. <laughs> Ooh, wow. Yeah, these are gorgeous. Oh, nice, the Oathgate Spren, and then Hoyd. I love the, all of the details in this. Girl who looked up, there's Vin, symbol for Harmony, symbol for First of the Sun, got Dragon, a shade? The Wander Sail, like, uh, it's so good. And then, <laughs> uh, Shard Bearer miniature. The Army Builder six pack. Ooh, the Bridge Display Stand. Just taking everything out of the big box and then we can do all the smaller boxes. Oh, the Oathbringer. Nail, Risen, and Zellion. The big Zeth. Oh yeah. Nightblood is sort of wonky in that, isn't he? Kaladin. Adolin. These are so cool. And Dalinar. Ah, oh, nice. Shallan. And Yasna. And the Rhythm of War collection. Words of Radiance. Oh, oh man. And then Way of Kings. Oh, and Syl, look at Syl! Look at Syl! We'll get to her. Oh, I'm so excited. The big old beastie chasm fiend. Oh my gosh. This is huge. And then... <laughs> Clashing Storms Resin Statue. Number 1448 of 5000. Yeehaw. Now we can go back to normal. Now the big decision is, do I actually, like, open these? Or do I keep them in their boxes to assuage my perfectionism? No, you know what? I should open it up. I should open them up. Let's get things organized. Build short stump. They made a set of miniatures for every book. Let's start off with the Way of Kings collection. Hey, Nightblood, come here. Well done. Ash and I. Wow. Yeah, the detail on these is fantastic. Lopin. Bridge Runner Kaladin. Oh, dang, that shield is spooky. Assassin Zeth in his classic face palm. Dalinar in his plate, Shallan, and Syl. I love what they did with Syl. That's so fun. Then we have Words of Radiance. Slight spoilers for all of the Stormlight books. Wit. What a... <laughs> Veil, aka Shallan 2.0. Looking sassy, little hip pop there. Teravangian. Oh, is he... He, oh man, he's crossing his fingers behind his back. Oh, that's so good. Pattern in Shadesmar form. Is that Adolin? Yep, Adolin. Oh yeah, this is the same Adolin as the fancy Adolin. Cracks in his shard plate. Rock with a bowl of stew. And then Captain Kaladin holding a sill spear. Next up is Oathbringer. Got, of course, Yasna doing her cover of Oathbringer pose. Relaine in war form. Dalinar. Doing a cool thing. Leshwi, I love this. I love what they did with the clo with her robes. Renarin with Gliss standing in front of stained glass. That's fantastic. There's Skybreaker Zeth. These are really cool. Yeah, the intricate details are fantastic. Lift. Oh, this is an amazing lift. I didn't know there there's a window. <laughs> That's so cool. And then finally, Rhythm of War. Oh. I recently finished my Rhythm of War read-through, so I have all of my notes for the Cosmere Connection series that will be coming soon. Navani. Maya. Doing a very important thing. Vire. Screw you, man. Adolin in Shadesmar. Oh, he goes nuts with that sword. And then Venli in Envoy form. Cal. Oh, that, that's a really cool design with the wind. Like, that's, that's fantastic. And Teft. Amazing. Amazing. Of course, in order to display, especially the members of Bridge 4, the Bridge Display Stand. Wow, okay, that's really cool. The most amazing thing to me about this entire campaign is that all of these versions of the characters are canon. Like, officially canon. These are what they look like. And so, presumably, this is what a bridge would look like, which makes sense, because they've got all of the spots for runners underneath, the handles on the sides. I believe in the book there are handles on the edges here to push across the chasms. That looks great. Then we've got, of course, the three secret ones. I need to add Taln. i got to grab Taln from the Stormlight box. 
So here we have Nail floating a little bit with his honor blade there. Risen, I love this. Ooh, interesting. It's not actually a wheelchair. I mean, there's a wheel on it, but it's not wheeled, which means this probably is later in the book. <laughs> with Cheery Cheery. Well, of course, yeah, because Cheery Cheery's looking chipper. And then Zellion. And we know what kind of spren that sword is. Then, just to take a peek, generic shard bearer. Ow, open. You think. No, come on, man. Ah! Oh my gosh. Ah! Wow, that was a trial. Shard bearer. There they are. Nice. Hua. And army builder pack. The three Alethi warriors, two spearmen, and an archer, and then three Parshendi. Swords, axes, there's a, an archer. Judging by the beards, it looks like all three of these Parshendi are Malin. Doesn't preclude them from being a war pair. We could match those guys up. Then the <laughs> massive chasm fiend. Gargantuan indeed. They tried to get all of these in the same scale, so if this is your average soldier, this is the size of a chasm fiend. Is bit is gonna eat ya. Oh, it's heavy. Wow. Oh, that's so cool. Again, the detail on this. Yeah, we should open these. Let's do it. Here's up close versions of Yasna from the Oathbringer set, Adolin Shardbearer from the Words of Radiance set, Dalinar Bondsmith from Oathbringer, Windrunner Kaladin from Words of Radiance, Skybreaker Zeth from the Oathbringer collection, and Shallan Lightweaver from Way of Kings. But, of course, the main reason why you're here is uh, the big box. Let's go get it. Everybody, go away. <laughs> oh, how does it come out? This is probably the wrong way to do it. Oh no. <laughs> here we go. This is how you put it together. Oh, oh, I'm gonna take the whole thing. Okay, we can we can work with this. Where am I going? Uh, right there, apparently. Uh, boxes. Welcome back. Hi. And first out of the gate, we have oh, more foam. Here is oh, Kaladin. Ah, oh, that's so cool. Wow. And Zeth. Boy needs to lay off the eyeliner. Put them right there. And then we gotta get out the big part. Oh, it's heavy. How do I know who goes where? Oh, yep. Magnets in right there. It shouldn't be hard to get out. You're just a cloud! Now, you can come over here. And Zeth, you can go right here. Oh, yeah. Those magnets aren't terribly secure. Ba -na -na -na. Amazing. All in all, this is a gorgeous statue. This is really, really awesome. Very high quality. The painting is really well done. The fact that they fit together is really fun. It's not a terribly clean fit. Like, it's not puzzle piecing together. The magneting system to get the figures on is a little weak. Like, I can just sort of poke Zeth and he wiggles. Kaladin's a lot more secure. But the look of this is really, really awesome. This is a gorgeous sculpture. All in all, I am amazed at the quality of these miniatures and of this sculpture. The, the products that Brotherwise has put out, these are impeccable. Like the packaging for everything, the design of all the figures, how closely they worked with Dragonsteel to produce this. This entire project has been amazing. Thank you, Brotherwise, and thank you, Dragonsteel, for, again, such awesome stuff. And of course, thank you to you, the viewer. Thanks for watching my videos. I just moved into a new space, so next week I'm going to do an actual bookshelf tour and show you all of the things that I have collected over my years of liking Sanderson. This act of collecting, of course, would not be possible without my patrons. Thank you so much for supporting me. Specifically, thank you to Doug, Matt, Steve, Data Gremlin, Alec, Craig, Scotty, James, and Dalinar's butt. I literally wouldn't be able to be where I am today without your guys' help, like, in this office. If you backed the Stormlight Minis Kickstarter, what is your favorite thing? And if you didn't, what do you wish you got? I'm excited to see your comments so I can read and find out!
The Stormlight Minis... Yes, my children call me Papa, and it's adorable. Ah! No casualties, we're fine. Bada bing.